Uh, what's up, fire signs? It's your girl Dominique with Empathic Guidance, and I'm back with another video for you guys today. And today I'm back with a weekly vibe, so let's see what's coming in. A feminine man self sabotage will self sabotage themselves this week, probably with you if you're the feminine listening, okay? Or a feminine man feel like you self sabotage, one or the other. So somebody lying about the reason why they really ghosted you. They sabotaged themselves and now they coming back with some type of lie. Something that's going to like make you feel bad. Like, oh, you know, it's trauma. You probably got CPTSD. Da, 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 da. You know, it's like this person may know that you an understanding and kind individual. You know, some of y'all probably like not that much. Like, <laughs> I don't know what they thought, but it, but... <laughs> I'm definitely seeing that, okay? Somebody definitely want to come back and explain why they ghosted you this week, okay? And this could have been three to six months ago. All right, but the, the reason that they giving you, again, it could be coming off like, well, I got a detached love style or, you know, I got abandonment issues or I'm, I'm afraid of intimacy. Like, this person going to try to come off very transparent because they know that's what you're seeking, but the truth of the matter is, it was enough. It was a whole nother reason, okay? It was a whole nother reason, loves. Oh, shit. I didn't even know I had that much time. This is going to be a short read, y'all. Because I forgot to empty out my storage. So, I might do y'all part two fire sign, especially if it starts to get juicy. Because I only got 13 minutes on here, okay? So, somebody here is trying to regain their soul. They might have felt like they sold their dang on soul. Like, this could be somebody that was super greedy and just ready to do whatever. Be toxic, turn up, raise hell, and be on demon time just to get a couple of dollars. And now it's like they ain't even got it. They ain't even got it. Glamour spells. Yeah. So, somebody about to come in and try to glamour y'all. And y'all know what I mean. Like, they want to come off innocent when they really not. Wolf and sheep's clothing energy. Okay, this person is coming out of the dark night of the soul. So they could have been, it's like, uh, they could have been going through something. That could have been a reason why. I mean, this person could have been having a ball living their life too. I don't know. But yeah, they definitely put rose tinted glasses on when it come down to you. You know, come down to getting what you get in a chance with you. Okay, they wasn't being authentic. So, yeah. They saying their heart is tender towards you. They not truly like this. But honestly, I'm getting rose tinted glasses. Authentic and reverse glamour spells. It's like this person just can't be real to say they like. For real. Mm-hmm. Okay, yeah. All right, so I feel like this person been trying to think of ways that they can summon you to basically reach out to them. That way they ain't have to even try to come up with some corny ass excuse. This person had to get rid of some type of sexually transmitted demons and they went to a grandmother to do this. So maybe their grandmother do spiritual cleanses. Okay, spirit is saying, let them fight their own battles. Why have gold when you can have glitter for cheaper? So that's what they did to self-sabotage. They went towards a much lower vibrational or lower quality individual okay they regret whatever high date they went on that led to y'all demise y'all could have felt it for some odd reason i'm getting this energy um where y'all felt it y'all might have been the ones that ghosted them but that's literally because y'all could feel a pattern arising in this person that y'all might have felt happen with other people like Maybe this is a, like, uh, I don't know. Sometimes, again, we'll perpetuate the same thing in order to make sure that we learned the lesson from a previous cycle. And this could definitely be, like, spirit. Like, let's see, like, how quick are you going to recognize that this is, like, an energy signature, like, this person do the same thing that other people from your past do, okay? And y'all caught on quick as hell this time. So this was definitely something that was new. Y'all walking in y'all life purpose. Okay, passing on to the spiritual realm. Wow, okay. Let's see what that's about. Okay, so we about to. Hopefully, their grandmother ain't passing on to the spiritual realm. Because one thing I know is that either either a um, low-fi practitioner turned them down, you know, told them they wasn't going to do work for them or something. Because this person been trying to get back in good with you, okay? I'm going to tell y'all what's up. Y'all was, was 
this could be somebody y'all was dating fire signs okay especially those of you that's single and it's like you guys are out you you, you just now getting back out there okay but y'all had experiences in the past that y'all had to heal from this person could have came in resembling something so great, okay? They could have been really open. They Like, their feminine side could have really be, been balanced within them. They could have been showing you a lot of care, love, um, being very nurturing towards you, always showing their affection, always complimenting you. And that's the whole glamour spell, rose-tinted glasses, authentic and reverse. This is not the real version of this person. Like, it's not the real version of this person. So, whatever ended up happening, the ghosting situation might not have been, like, uh, ghosting you for months and months. This could have been, like, this person ghosted you for a night. Or, you know, they they had time that was unaccounted for where you could have been waiting to hear from them or even waiting to see them. And it's like this person wasn't showing up, okay? I'm getting what ended up happening. They ended up going on some type of uh, hot date and they got a STD from that, all right? So this person, like if they disappear for a little while, they probably had to wait till some penicillin kicked in or some shit like that. I don't know. Um, but this person did go to go towards somebody that's cheap. And the thing is, is that y'all, if you guys are newly dating, you know, and I know how y'all vibe with y'all vessels or whatever in y'all temples. It's like, y'all could have been having this person wait. So this person could have thought, well, you know what? All is fair. This person is celibate or they with, you know, with uh, holding from sex till they get to know me. So, you know, basically we still in the getting to know you process or whatever. Like, this is how this person is thinking. But even if y'all made it official, they feel like they ain't do shit wrong when they did it because they felt like y'all was newly dating. So it's kind of like, we ain't having sex yet. And it's because y'all on y'all life purpose. And because y'all on y'all life purpose, also, you got hella signs that you couldn't ignore about this whole situation. I feel like this person definitely tried to come back and lie about why they ghosted you. They did. Whatever it was. It The truth was they was on a hot date that night. <laughs> okay? This could be somebody with a beard. This person is stuck in their ways. Like, yeah, when it comes down to seduction and, like, wanting to get their way from women, it's like they stuck in their ways. If they don't get it from one, they gonna get it from some period you know so um it's like y'all just are really clear clever and wise all right and maybe that's something this person didn't quite understand about you but uh y'all highly intellectual a spirit is saying continue doing what y'all doing and that's what y'all are gonna do like y'all not gonna let this person get you off path or pressure you into you know um intimacy before you ready because whoever this is anyway you did good to wait because this person not who they come off to be they not all right so yeah they did cure whatever it is that they had so if they ghosted you for a minute even if it was just for a week y'all i'm telling you this is what happened they went on a they went on some type of blind date and they did so now somebody learning a valuable lesson sometimes it's not your lesson it's their lesson okay so, yeah, somebody might have repeated the same mistake that other people did in the past by not wanting to be patient, not wanting to take the time to get to know you on a personal level or on a soul level before they want to engage in deeper things with you. And this person is learning why that's important. They learning why you a martyr for your beliefs. Somebody is learning a lesson through their own mistakes. Okay. Because this person might have been thinking like, you know what, I don't I don't really like women or men that's like that. They might think that that's prude, it's boring. But see, now somebody is seeing why. It's like because not only do people be having diseases, but they be having demons, period. And y'all know that. Whether y'all heard it through the grapevine, whether y'all learned it through study, or whether y'all had to experience it for y'all self. And that was something that y'all had to clear or cleanse off of y'all. And y'all don't want to happen. Y'all don't want it to happen to y'all again. So my thing is, this could be a situation where y'all just very careful, you know. And this person was not, and they seeing now why you are. Okay, it was meant for this person to gain a new perspective when it comes down to like uh, their sexuality and how easily they surrender their body over to somebody that they don't know. Like, this is what this was supposed to do for this person. They were supposed to see a new way of being, okay? We only got about three minutes left, y'all. Y'all definitely gonna have to have a part two because I gotta clear my storage and start again. Y'all, extremities. So, my thing is, you could have been waking up in the middle of the night having dreams and visions about what this person was doing 
at the times that they wasn't answering your phone call or reaching out to you okay with these extremes it, i'm getting like waking up in the middle of the night but also it's extremes in this person like maybe they have fever you get what i'm saying like maybe they woke up in the middle of the night with fever somebody here could be 34 years old somebody could be extremely dehydrated thirsty constantly having to drink water with unquenchable thirst okay a new start is coming is in reverse because somebody here definitely sabotaged they self-sabotaged it and yes with this nourishment energy, you take care of yourself. All right? So thank your ancestors. Make them a plate today if you didn't yesterday. For real. But yeah, it's like you guys, y'all nourish y'all body. Y'all take care of y'all body. And this is a tough change that this person is going to have to go through here. Okay? I mean, my thing is, whatever it is, is cured. But again, this is something that this person is meant to go within about. Yeah, your hard work is paying off. Is in reverse. Some of y'all can have Capricorn in y'all chart, or this person could be a Capricorn. The end of a tough cycle approaches. So even if you don't start to see, like, your hard work paying off, this week is on the horizon, okay? Because a tough cycle is coming to an end. Because you... Like, my thing is, you was tested in many ways. Are you going to give in a peer pressure? That's one. Check. You didn't. You passed that test. Number two, when this person came back lying and trying to make it seem like they ghosted you for another reason, you know, people would be like, oh, I had to work. I lost my phone. I dropped my phone in the toilet. Uh, da, 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 da. You know, they make up all type of excuses like that. You saw what was going on. Now, of course, this person, yeah, they could have been like an energy vampire or wolf in sheep's clothing, like I said, all right? And maybe this is a test that you had to pass, but also a test, a, a lesson that you had to teach in order for somebody to move forward because somebody have to make adjustments in their life and quick or it's going to be something worse next time, okay? It's, it's pretty much set in stone that this is over because you don't trust this person anymore. You got boundaries up to them. All right, y'all, we gonna go ahead and tap into a part two. So look for y'all part two.